All right, so here we are back at Jeff's today. That's Jeff right here. Jeff's, Jeff's gonna be my new voiceover guy. Hold on, let's go get let's go get some audio from Jeff. Jeff, Jeff, we need you to be on the TV show today. Yeah, well, I need your voice because you're gonna be my voiceover guy. So I want everybody to hear the sultry sound of your voice, man. No, I don't want to be on that thing. Come on, just give me a little. Just give me a little. Oh, I'll be showed up somewhere and. It's all right. You told you're in it. It's totally fine, man. This is what this is what retired life looks like, everybody. Yeah. Sweatpants, flip flops, t-shirt, all day. So anyway, we're gonna pour this porch here. Right here, we're gonna pour this. We're gonna stamp it with uh, some of these stamps here, and uh, yeah, it's gonna be our plan. So, Tyler. Yeah. What are the odds it rains on us while we're doing this today? 45 minutes. Till it rains? Yep. I give it an hour. Chances are high we're getting wet while we're doing this. In other words, 100%. All right, so we got this all poured. It started raining, as you can tell. So we've got it all tarped in up there. And it's pretty much ready to go. We just gotta stamp it here. So I'll show you guys what it looks like after we stamp it because it looks pretty cool. But uh, can't really film and stamp because it's real dusty, shitty, and it's wet out now. So it's gonna be it's gonna be awful. It's gonna be awful. <sighs> All right. So this is what a stamp patio looks like. In the brick stamps we got. Come back, wash the dust off once it sets up, and then it'll be real nice. I may stop back by, take a shot of it. But this is it for right now. They are uh, definitely spread manure in one of the fields nearby, and it stinks like shit out here. Yep. Gym time, though. Just got off the sweat machine, now it's time to put in some actual work here. Lifting back today. All right, just finished up at the gym here. Hit a, hit a solid back workout, but uh, not the longest one I've ever done. But I gotta go home and meet Matt. He's coming over, he's gonna fix my oven for me. Thank God, because I got a couple powder projects sitting there I gotta finish. Uh, and right now I can't bake anything, because the oven doesn't work. So, get home and meet up with him for that. All right, one. so we got Matt over here fixing shit. How's this going, Matt? Good, I just can't read numbers. Okay, that's good. That, that's helpful when hooking up electronic wires here that are gonna run on high voltage. And I think I need a longer screwdriver. I mean, there's only one reason I bought that long of one. To scratch your butthole? No, actually it's to reach an F4I frames to undo the middle, screw, uh, middle screws on the throttle body, but you know, you could have pretty much gone either way with that. That's totally fine. All right, cool. So Matt got this all hooked up. New controller is slightly smaller than the old ones, so no big deal. Right now we're just running a test heat cycle on it, so we'll see where she gets to, and then hopefully we'll be cool with that. Had a minor blowout here on the air system, the hose that goes into the powder booth. Um, it Actually, what I think happened to it is it got uh on my old system i didn't have an air cooler and i would run the old um compressor for just like a couple hours at a time and it would it would get really hot and air would be really hot so i think what it did was actually fucked up the inside of that air hose so i'm gonna have to go tomorrow morning and get a new one uh what we're doing currently here 
is working on these chairs. We're tightening up the bolts on them here. And then um, as you can see, these bolts actually stick out quite far. So what we're doing is we're actually cutting them off and then filing them smooth uh, so that that way you don't get caught on them when you're sitting here. Um, so I got this side ready to go cut. I gotta get this side ready to go and then I'll cut these all and file them and be good to go. Then we'll work on that chair. I've got one done back there and I've got three more to assemble. So um, that's currently what we're doing here. Also, before Matt got here, uh, we got the rims here, the old 80 Trans Am rims, uh, blasted off and ready to go. So these are ready for powder tomorrow, as long as the oven works. I have these pieces, the screws, and there's some long, I don't know if you can see them back there. Let's see here, can we focus, focus. See these long aluminum brackets or trim pieces here? Those are all going to get coated tomorrow with the wheels here. Um, so that's gonna be our big goal for tomorrow is get the wheels, these pieces, and the aluminum pieces back there all coated. And uh, yeah, pretty much gonna be it. So um, just gonna wait for that to heat up, get these chairs finished popped off. They, I think they look pretty good, these Michigan chairs here. I think they look pretty good. So if anybody's looking for some custom folding chairs, we can do it. Any school you want, we can make it happen. So, uh, but yeah, that's pretty much going to be it for the uh, for the vlog tonight, I think. So um, we will uh, see everybody tomorrow.